Getting set for race number six from Red Shores in Charlottetown tonight. It is the Colonel Dan Trot as they swing in behind the Metro Home Building Center starting gate. Vance Cameron going to be a good one. Up to you for the call. Medjian Tanko. Go with her. Freddy. Daisy River Oxford Delta. Cheeky little minx. Top of the stretch. Here they come. It's the Colonel Dan Trot, and it's post time. The rough and trotting Daisy River is all leaving out. Freddy going into the turn is second. Cheeky little Minx up on the outside to be third. Go with her, checks in fourth. Then Magian Tango fifth, and Osprey Delta is the early trailer. To the back stretch they go. Daisy River in line to the Blue Knight. Jason Hughes by two and a half early. Second, that is Freddy dropping in third is Cheeky Little Minx. All alone in fourth is go with her. Back into fifth is Magian Tango trailing the field. Osprey Delta, they are rolling here. 28 and one. They trot to the opening quarter. Rounding the turn for the first time over to the 3-8. Daisy River the leader. Second, that's Freddy. Cheeky little minx. Continuing third with the leader's fourth. That is go with her. Gapping in fifth is Magian Tango. And trailing the field, Osprey Delta. They're halfway home. And the Colonel Dan led by Daisy River. Second is Freddy. Cheeky little minx. A racing third. 57 Two was the half mile. We're down to three eighths to go. Daisy River on top. Freddy second. Cheeky Little Minx third. Fourth is go with her. Osprey Delta moving up fifth. Now the trailer. Magian Tango. They arrive at three quarters next. Daisy River has not seen a challenger. Freddy along the rail second. Racing third. Cheeky Little Minx. The three quarters up in one. 127 and 2. They have a shot at the track record here. Homeward bound, led by Daisy River. Second is Freddy. Cheeky Little Minx. Third, deep stretch. Now, Daisy River. Freddy is coming. Daisy River looking to hang on. Freddy is in the win photo. Cheeky Little Minx is third. A new track. Record 156 and one. Okay, here's the slow mo for race number six. The Colonel Dan Trot. We'll see it here. Universal Media. Who got there in the end? Wow, that's tight. We're going to see the slow-mo here. Ken Workington, Daisy River right down the road, and Freddie out of the clouds. Yeah, Daisy River off that uh, crushing first over victory in 156 and four-fifths. And up on the board, we see the four Daisy Rivers going to hold on here with Jason Hughes. Freddie, who had that uh, apparently uh, reportedly weight issues recently, he sat the two-hole, and he slingshotted and gave it all he could here. The nine-year-old by Majestic Sun, a former track record holder, took his late lunge at Daisy River. She is going to hold on here with Jason Hughes for William Lanigan. The six-year-old mare does it again in 156-1 and one with a 28-4 and four final quarter. Freddie right there in the bang-bang finish with the six cheeky little minx finishing third. Congratulations to the winning connections of Daisy River, the hobble trotter here by Nike's Image with a new track record in the Colonel Dan Trot. And guess what? Yeah. It was this close. That close right here at the wire. Look at this Universal Media slow-mo here. They're going to freeze it here at the wire, folks. Take a look at this. There's the nose of Daisy River. Freddie late. Oh, my land. And Kenny, the crowd up here, unbelievable the reaction up here live and uh, during the photo. That's racing. That's racing right there. Awesome race in the Colonel Dan Trot.
Here she comes, the fastest trotter in East Coast harness racing history. She is Daisy River, trotting Bay Mare 6 by Nike's image. From the Northern Bailey Dam, Rosie River, a homebred of Bill Lanigan of Montague. Bill does the training in the hands of the Blue Knight, Jason Hughes. She makes everyone call a winning one on this night. The new track record of 156 and 1. Bill Lanigan, I salute you. Daisy River, the fastest trotter ever in the East Coast. 156 and 1. Congratulations, the Blue Knight doubles up.